So, so this is what you find out, right? This is a uh, super high quality steel, you know, I think it's an eight foot level, right? This is about as big as a level as you can get. But when you're starting at one point and we started at the high point with the biggest beam, right? That sort of sets where everything else goes and you work your way across, if you're using just a level like this, you'll find that by the time you get from there to there, you'll be off by inches. What does this beam weigh? This one probably weighs, so let's see, it's a W12 by probably like 50 or 60. So the W12 means that it's a wide flange section is W12 means it's approximately 12 inch deep. And then when it says by 50 or 60, that means it's by 50 or 60 pounds per foot. So 60 pounds per foot times 20 feet, 1200 pounds, something like that. So each one of these, so I told you that we, you know, came out and did an as built of our piers. They don't necessarily all, aren't exactly all going perfectly in the middle. Our plan is that they're all going perfectly in the middle, but sometimes you miss in reality, right? So after we defined where exactly all the piers were, then we adjusted the steel and we have another drawing that they're using on their iPad that says that this center line of steel is actually one and a quarter inches south of center so that we know exactly where they're going because if you don't have a plan, by the time you get to the end, you're gonna be like, I'm off, I'm missing completely, right? So every one of these was adjusted and has its own like properties in our program that just tells us exactly how long it is once you adjust it. So the reason that this is higher than this is because this is the main house and this is actually the outdoor covered living. So they have different structural assemblies, right? So here across this span are our two foot deep trusses that run north and south, okay? So there's a plate and then there's a two foot deep truss. Now, if I told you that this finished floor is actually going to be higher than that one, you might be confused since that one's higher, right? Mm -hmm. This is a two-foot truss, okay? Then you're going to take one step down, but this is only a 12, a 2 by 12 right? So you have this offset of height, and so we planned those accordingly so the 2 by 12 sits across here. You still get your one step down, and then you know, everything's at the right height.